Hey guys, this is Garis. Welcome back to another episode of Survival Vietnam. We're back here on Grounded and it's early in the morning. So we just slept and I just woke up. And I want to show you something. There was a bunch of updates done to the game. And some things have changed. So right there we have a dotties or the cursories or the crosshair. <laughs> Dot as a crosshair. Is um, there's something weird there. So if we go looking at that with the field of view. We can see it a little bit closer. So I think we're going there today. Going to explore that strange object. It looks like a child's toy maybe. And then we're quickly going to do a update with our build. Um, let's do that from here. I uh, hope we can see. Whoops. Oh no. My <laughs> son is kind of messing it up. So that's our new overdone base so i still have to get some lily pad or not lily pad clover leaves for the circle so we'll go there and i'll show you guys how that looks but yes that took me a couple of uh, real life days to get that that far really it took quite a long time i harvested some things um, not some things, um, the stems, wheat stems, over and over and over. So uh, so one of the updates is water now drips to the bottom. It goes lie at the bottom here. And you have to pick it up there. The timer for growing mushrooms has changed. And something that's actually awesome that I really love, that I thought would have been implemented way back when, is if you chop down a grass and you chop down the stem part of it, it won't regrow. Like this. This one will regrow. But if we chop it down, now it won't regrow anymore. So that's kind of cool. So what I did here is I opened paths where... Oh, I must chop this one down. Where the dandelion will regrow once we chop... Oh, not regrow. Fall once we chop it down so that we can it up e more easily because sometimes they go with the stems goes by up in the <coughs> the v necks or whatever you call it over grass and then you struggle to find it or pick it up so i've done that <coughs> excuse me so i cleared out that i didn't do it everywhere i did it over there at the back of the baseball uh, I still need to do it here, but I've been farming so much I didn't get a chance to do everything. So, um, our staircase is obviously done. Oh, there's a feather. You see, it lies in the grass. So we definitely need to finish this platform that we want to do. And then I've also cleared out a piece of grass over there where those two then lines fall. So we just need to clear out a bit here where this one falls. And then we need to clear out where these four falls. So basically this whole area we need to clean out. So I'm also going to rip out the stems so that the, <laughs> the grass doesn't regrow. So this is the inside of our base. Doesn't really look pretty or anything actually. This is uh, the scaffolding I built. I built it right here. So we'll only break down this one and the whole scaffolding all around will fall so also something that changed look at at the bottom of the screen it says now recycle supporting 49 so that means if we break this 49 other structures will break if you go here it's only 48 and this is 47 so if you break this one it's 47 all around plus this one 48 so that's interesting so I put all the stems that was needed all around and this is where we need the um, clover leaves and this is our staircase that will go to our room which we need, need to build today or not build the uh, blueprint build so I'm not sure if I think we should still use this what do you guys think I why not so this one is the one that comes up that's one, two, three. One, two, three. So are we going to make it a too wide outside? Yes, why not? Then we have quite a 
wide interior. Um, let's just see. So there. So it's one, two, and then this over here. That one there. Is it's there, right? Yes. Right there. Run down this side. And it's there. There. Oops, wrong button. Okay, now in the middle, we need to put a doorway. Just making sure this is a correct doorway. Okay, steady door. Right there. It doesn't really look like the metal if you look at the staircase. Just making sure it's metal, yes. Okay, so then we can put windows here, here. The other one is a wall. Oh, and I also changed it. You can't build anymore on top before you haven't built the bottom part. So that actually kind of makes sense. Um, now, if there's no supporting structure, you can't build. Okay. Windows. We'll put windows everywhere. So I'm thinking we're going to make this one two eye or three eye. What do you guys think? Two eye and the third one is a slope. I think that will work out. Uh, so we will need windows there, 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 there. Ooh, we didn't make it skew edges. Oh, well, that's fine. You're in the wrong place. Okay, so once again, I'll show you guys what we're going to do. And in off cam, I'll build this. And for now, as I said, we're going to go explore that toy thing, whatever that is. <clears throat> Getting walls. Maybe we should do this walls. And I'm hungry. Choke it down, Pete. Oh, it's worse than Dad's Brussels sprouts. Okay, so we build this outward. Okay. So this way actually makes it that we have less <laughs> um, stems to harvest. But that's okay. We're doing it over done. <laughs> The grind is unfortunately quite a tick in this game. Especially if you want to go over done. Oh, where did you snap to? That snapping was weird. Okay. So, that will be the top part and then we will put roof corner again right there yes looks right that one over there Ooh. <laughs> at least I didn't fall maybe I should put some oh that would actually be good uh, what do you call it can't get the name now um, some of those fence, sprig fences. Just do a few of these. Whoops, where did. How and where did you snap to?
again, that was just weird. Oh, that was a fence. Okay, oh, window. Okay, roof again. Sorry, I hope this isn't too boring, guys. Just want to show you guys the layout. Spend a few minutes on this and then we're going to go exploring. Okay, then obviously we'll have more, more cro grass plank, roof or ceiling or what it, whatever it's called. Okay. And... You know what I'm thinking now? Maybe we should make some sort of watchtower. Way up high. Ah, but this is so high already. I don't think it's necessary. Ah, we can see everything from here. Let me know down in the comments. Do you guys want the watchtower as well? You can always edit it so it'll break down the middle part and build something. It's fine. Don't worry. <clears throat> okay, so and then for decor, we'll use a sprig fence. Okay, so what I meant is we'll do this. And then we can't walk down the stairs from the wrong side. And as I mentioned, I'll do this off cam. So I won't do the harvesting and running back and forth gathering resources. Because that's the other thing. This is only being able to carry eight items at a time is actually kind of uh, brain dead running up and down the stairs, especially this high stairs. Oh, and something I figured out. You can add the last second and you press the button for the fluff, the dandelion fluff, so that you don't die. So that was interesting. Have you created water? You have. You see, the water goes down and Don't even need crouch. to boil it. Okay, let's grab some of these. Oh, what do I have in my inventory? Nothing. Let's change gear. What equipment is we want? A dagger. Just in case we don't want to lose that. Let's take the bow in case and then obviously we need this. We can yeah, let's keep that. And that should be very fine. And then we want different gear. safer now. And the fence is not a lot. Don't they show the max defense that we have? Status. Ah, okay, we can probably take off that one. What's this one? Ant annihilator. No, no. Let's do this one. This is what we got when we um, harvested the the mint chunks. Where is that? I think it's here. And chunks. So I wonder um, if that respawned. Doubt it. What do we need again for the mallet? Um, workbench tools. Mint mallet. Silk rope. Oh yeah, and they added. Um, where is that? Utilities, I believe. A spinning wheel. So you need to spin materials into threads. So that is something they added. Um, there was something else, I think, if I remember correctly. Decor. They put the signs, yes. Oh, and something I saw in the previous, after the previous update, I haven't told, showed you guys. You can make a custom marker for each um, chest. So let's say this is fuzz. Okay, so we can say custom marker, fuzz, white, red. See, now it shows a fuzz, basically. Oh, well, I'm guessing that's fuzz. Uh, what is this? This is goop. So, what will be goop? That one? Goop and greenish. Uh, what's that? And, and bar. So, say... Um, that's an ant, right? That's spider, that's ant. Ant, and it's red. What's that? That is a What was that? Hmm. Don't know. 
Ladybug. I don't think there's Ladybug. But there's spiders, so we can say that was a spider and it ugh, grows gray. I don't know. Ah, so you can put different markers on each, so that's kind of cool. Um, I didn't plan on doing this, sorry. <laughs> I'm thinking about it. Let's do it. So that, this is... So this is stones, okay? So we make it stones. Gray, okay? This is quartzite, so that's also stones. That's more white. This is clay, so this is also stone and red. And this is mint. Mm. Let's make it sparkly and white. And this is feathers. Hmm. Don't know. But yeah, you get the idea. So you can put different types of markers on it. That's kind of cool. And then you can, as I mentioned, you can <coughs> get the um, sign frame. They can. I'm guessing you use the same things for that. Resources. Stink bug. Gas sack. Ooh. Oh, we haven't. We need to research those things. Let's research those things. Silk rope. Okay. So basically, everything that the silk takes over this. Everything that uses silk, the spider silk, uh, all the recipes that use it is now taken over by silk rope. Okay, rotten larva blade did not last long. Really, it only had a few uses. So it's nice for early game actually. Okay, let's see. Analyze thing bug gas sack and ladybug head. Okay, I think we have those. Ladybug head, stink bug, gas sack. Right? Okay, let's quickly analyze those. Um, we already did, so I don't know why the marker doesn't go away. Oh, and I also logged in with my Xbox account, or well, my Microsoft account works with <laughs> the Xbox Live. And now we are, can actually log bugs for guys. Yep, you see, we can't analyze it. So maybe I should log a bug. Anyway, I'll do that afterwards. Let's go take this back. And let me bring you back in the morning. Of course, it's already late. And then we'll go explore that thing we saw over there. Something else I also noticed that changed with the update. Nice and clean. It feels like it's getting dark. More of more quickly. I'm not hundred percent certain about that one, but yeah, it does seem like that. As I say, I might be wrong, completely wrong. Okay, so we need to head into this general direction. So we did equip those. Let's equip that. Um, we sand it with this direction. Ooh, that's soldier ant. I don't want to battle soldier ant right now. Oh, wow. a lot more ant activity around. Huh. I wonder if they aggro. Well, probably just one way to find out, right? Okay. Looks like they're good. Okay, good, good. I'm just gonna run by, not try to aggro them at all. Let's jump on here. See, all is good. 
Oh, you see there's a feather. Remember in the previous episode I mentioned the feathers? But why is the ant so active? That's new. It actually scares me a little bit because usually the times I saw the spider, uh, the soldier ants, they aggroed on me. Oh, and look at the knife's tip. It changed a bit. That's interesting. I wonder what else changed. Kaolin 2 is still here. Let's set spawn point. Just in case. Here's water. Let's go grab some water. Where did that waterfall? Oh no. Okay. That water is lost. And the clay does not seem like it respawned yet. So that's a bad problematic. So that means building this side is kind of out of the question. Of course, getting more clay around here is going to be difficult. Okay, so it was over by dead grass. I wonder, can we run up that? Looks like it. Yes, we can. Oh, we must make a far away base on one of these flat rocks. That would look cool. Because it's flat. So we don't have to build pillars like this one. Look at how nice big this one is. So we can maybe bring a... Oh, we can see our base from here. <laughs> it just looks like a table or something from this angle, but still. It's cool. Oh, here it is. Um, oh, so we can maybe make a walkway. The one going there, we can split off this side. That might be cool. Okay, so what is this? Frankenline. There's a ladybug. And just checking if there's spiders close by. Doesn't look like it. I'm hungry, I'm hungry. Oh! Worse than my mom's Brussels sprouts. Okay. There is something inside here. Okay, or not. He's scaring me. So what does this do? There's one dot there. Oh! Oh! Ace draw down, W draw up. Oh well, <laughs> that's just going to be uh, as tedious as farming in this game, drawing something on that thing. Hello, ooh, that was a glitch. Don't jump me. Okay, let's see if we can get a bombardier beetle pot. I know there's a spot here somewhere. Oh, we need flower petals. Ooh, there's spider webs. 
There's a spot here that we can jump onto. I think it's that rock. There's bombardier beetles usually close by there. With all the changes, I'm so afraid and <laughs> scared of moving around now. Especially with the sol soldier ants also running around. Well, I think I'm more quick than a spider. And also, they don't go into water. Research, where's all the research? Ah, there it is. You know what? I'm gonna try it. Of course, I don't think once it's over here, I don't think it can jump there follow us there so if we run from it come stand here we might be able to shoot it Oof. come on nope it lost aggro that's stupid That's very stupid. Okay, so it seems like there's only certain spots. Come at me, orb weaver. Nope. Them, you know? Ah, I lost aggro. Stupid spider. It does say threat engaged, so hopefully it keeps a threat. Oh, it's stuck behind a plant. Let's see. Do you think we'll be able to make it? Spider, you're in the wrong spot. Ach, not spider, ant. Well, if that thing is dead... I see you to the left. Did you go? Okay, we need to eat and drink something. No. No Slip. water filtration tablets needed. What's your chances that it'll get stuck to? Doubt it, right?
Okay, there's two orb weavers for us. Hopefully. What happened here? Well, that's a weird place to get stuck, but I'm not complaining. <laughs> Got it. Great. Oops. Okay. You got two orb weavers. Oh no, not another one. Just heard those screeching noise and there's some legs. Oh no. Oh, and one of the update notes I've read, it um, they removed the brute mother from the edge. I didn't know there was something like a brute mother. That's kind of scary. Very, very scary. Yeah, so um, if you look at, watch my ARC videos, Brute Mother is a massive, massive, massive spider. Oh, there he goes. Oh, here's flower petals. This is what we're looking for. I'm keeping quiet because I'm trying to listen. There's also a feather, but I think that feather is lost. I'm not gonna harvest it here. I'll run by and grab the petals. How many petals is that? Only three? No way, man. Well, if that plant showed us anything. It might be that the uh, spiders get stuck behind this plants, and so do we. I wanna go get the petals. Oh, there's a couple of feathers here, guys, so if you wanna harvest, take a chance and come harvest these. I'm not going to at this moment. Oh wow, there's a lot. Oh, there's another spider. Geronimo! <laughs> Just running and grabbing. That's all I'm doing. Let's go see if you can see what type of spider that is. I'm now looking for trouble. <laughs> oh well. After a few building episodes, I think that's a nice break. What do you guys think? Oh, that one is still stuck there. Might be able to get our arrow, arrow. What's the chances that we'll be able to shoot it from here? I doubt any. I doubt that very much. Oh, we did. Okay, but now it's not stuck anymore. Aww. Hmm. Okay, now I'm <laughs> scared to go that way. <laughs> Yeah, I wanted to go look for trouble, now I found it, eh? Well, we can probably jump from there to here, else we'll fall in the water. Which isn't a... Okay, if all goes well, we're getting a third orb weaver. That's if all goes well. Well, his front legs is in the air. Right there. Oh, 
Okay. I'm not hearing another one. Which is probably good. Oh! This gave me such a fright. This body just popping up. <laughs> Okay, can we harvest this? No, we can't. Oh, it sucks. Can we maybe harvest the petals if we run up here? Does not look like it. Okay. But I saw this one. Actually, I should have brought my other axe. Okay, well, <clears throat> let me head back to base and I'll bring you back so that we can do an outro because this episode is way over time. Let's see if I can grab that arrow. Yes, I can. <clears throat> okay, we got home without any problems. I just backtracked a little bit and I came through the grass over here somewhere. Actually, now that I look at it, I actually went the roundabout way. Anyway, it doesn't matter. We're safe and sound at home. And it's a route that I know is safe. Uh, we went through that canyon I showed you guys the previous time that we could harvest silk. And I also harvested some silk at one of those um, spider webs that we saw when we, came, uh, when we went over to the pot. So we were just over there. Anywho, that's a base from this angle, with a light behind us, not in front of us. So hope you guys enjoy that. Or not, look, hope um, that it looks nice. <laughs> Anywho, um, so let's call it an episode. Thank you for joining me, guys. Hope you enjoyed th that we hunted spiders for a change in place of building. Okay, we did do a bit of building in the first part of this episode, but that's okay, I think. I hope so. So I'll finish that building. Um, and then we'll bring you back in the next one but there might be a little bit of time between this episode and the next um, there's some real life stuff happening that I need to take care of and then I'll bring you guys back in the next one but for now I'm going to greet you thank you for joining me guys hope you enjoyed the episode if you did please give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and I will see you in the next one cheers